uh, the main area also to, for preserving the, the birds, the, the migratory birds and resident birds that live here. This is their habitat. No? Do you think any of the birds that come through our area down in South Alabama that come here? It's possible. I really the white pelican I've seen in yes, both areas. The, the American pelican uh, come here from November to April. Here's a great little example. Mixing in plants, flowering plants with your vegetables. Maybe it's hard to see, but all these little white butterflies. Closer up, you can see these. Really understanding the concept of integrated pest management here on the Chinopolis. Sometimes out in the field, you have to make some make decisions. Tough mm -hmm. decisions. Tough decisions. Improvise. Does is this typical Mexican tool making? Oh yeah. Yeah. And and six and six ancestral 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 uh huh you've been you've passed this down you've From had this generation past, to yeah. generation <laughs> yeah the grandfather of my grandfather <laughs> it just comes naturally huh <laughs> <laughs> it's so clever I think you should sell these to every um, Earth Watch expedition ex explain it. <laughs> All right, so I guess what you're doing is just using the uh, magnifying glass to burn. Mm -hmm. Didn't we do this when we were kids? Yeah, and like our parents told us not to do it, but I mean, you found a purpose. What is he burning? Why? Explain. Oh, all right. So why'd you decide to do this? Who, me? Yeah, why'd you decide to burn it? Because if we use uh, Sharpie, it will fade out. But if we Explain burn it. It will never fade it's a measure out. stick. Explain it. So and carving. What are the what do these numbers mean? That's the depth. Well, we use this. This is a measure of the distance. So we sure this. We use this stick to measure the, the depth of the canal. Why don't you use a measuring tape? Yeah. Yeah. So we we might use a measuring uh, rod or something, but we don't have one. Why not? Because we cannot find one in the stores. <laughs> You can't find one in the stores. I think so. <laughs> Never found, found any. Do you, do you think we it was? Do you think it was stolen? And a row and a rod, and that's it. But I lost the tape yesterday. Do you think somebody stole it? The tape? No. <laughs> Fell off my pocket into the canal. So this is my. <laughs> And they yeah. fill up so fast, and then they're like, well, what, what are we, what's the point? <laughs> so we've been trying to figure out ways to show them. We've been moving them around, trying to figure out how to show them how it can be useful. Can you talk about your water management? Uh, this is a rainwater catchment system. In Mexico City, we have a lot of rain we used to have a lot of rain during the summer, uh, but during the dry season we can get rid of water, absolutely. And in the Chinampas, uh, the problem is that the water from the canals are cold, so they need to water to water the product. And this is a good system. It is called it has about 24 meters. And, uh, and then it looks like you got a new guy here. And then it's this uh, garbage, uh, so the leaves and the big stuff that you want are reproduced. And uh, 